so these are grown so well so i wash them dry off and then make fritters with this these are the fresh plucked coriander so ready for fritters very tasty very you have to serve this when it's hot it stays crispy so very few ingredients needed to make this and these plants are very easy to grow in your uh, garden just sow some seeds and it's ready to be eaten within a month the ingredients list let us check today i will show you coriander leaf fritters so it is uh, fried in a different way so i will fry it with the stem so i'll keep this uh, see you can see i've cut this with the stem and then i will deep fry it ingredients needed to make this fritters are very few so these are the coriander leaves with the stem so the whole thing will go inside the batter and i'll deep fry it and in the dry spices this is red chili powder turmeric powder this is baking soda white oil for cooking water and this is gram flour or besan and ajwain so first thing we'll make the batter the batter will be a thick batter it will be almost semi thick so add everything soda ajwain red chili powder turmeric powder everything goes in i will add water so water just pour in small uh, quantities so that you can know how it is made it shouldn't be runny so this is the way we make beguni which is called uh, the brinjal fritters so we make it this way lot of people has eaten coriander uh, in a small uh, chunk size pieces not running these fritters i ate recently in a place called bokhali so they were serving this thing the uh, the fritters as a whole coriander leaves with the stem and it tasted awesome added some white oil so now with the help of a whisk mix it well so there are no lumps you can serve this dish with dal and rice or even you can eat it as a snack so this batter is made you can see how thick it is now i'll heat the oil uh, in a pan and you have to add enough oil you have to deep fry these added oil in this pan taken a large pan so that i can fry it and now i'll add salt to taste i'm taking this folding it a bit and now i'll dip
dip it nicely and then add it in your pan. So I'll add one more. You can see. This will give the shape of a beguni and it looks nice. This is the reason I've taken a large pan so that you can dip it at once. Don't turn it over right now. Let it get fried on one side. So now I'll turn this. Isn't it looking pretty? You have to serve this when it is hot. So you have to fry in this till it turns golden. Very quick and easy dish to make. So now I'll take this out. Drain this in a kitchen towel. And same way I'll fry others too. So let me come back after frying all of them. So friends you can see this Coriander fritters are ready and served. It's hot. So you have to eat this when it is hot. So uh, you can enjoy that crispiness of it. So do try this recipe and definitely lo uh, let me know in my comment section. Very simple to make and a easy recipe as a snack or in your side dish. Do let me know. Please like my channel with your friends and family. 
and leave a comment and don't forget to press uh, the like button. Thank you.